Yes. Camless Restaurant, Kyle speaking. How are you today? I'm sorry? How are you today? I'm very well. How are you this evening? I'm not happy. Well, how can I assist you? Um, I've had a very um, embarrassing dinner. My goodness, I, I'm, I'm so sorry to hear this. May I please have uh -huh. a brief hold? I'd love to leave the dining room so that I can hear you well, and I'd love to hear uh, oh, your me. experience. Okay, good. Just one, just one moment, please. Thank you. Fucking hell. Oh, fuck me. Much better. Okay. Bingo. Bingo. Right. Camel's restaurant, this is Madison. How are you today? I'm well, how are you? I'm absolutely devastated. Okay. How can I help make it better? Um, I've had a very um, embarrassing dinner. Okay. Anyway, it started off good. I arrived and I thought it was actually quite a stunning, intimate little place. Then the food arrived. Unfortunately, the food is shit. Oh, I see. Yeah. May I have your last name, sir? Were you dining this evening? Tonight. Seven o'clock. Michael Burns. Yeah. And fucking ridiculous prices. Who's in charge of the dining room? Um, Kyle Johnson is our service director. Let me grab him for you. Because yeah, I want to find out well, who the donkey is here. Okay. Thank you, sir. Just a moment. Move your ass. What the hell is going on here? What the hell are you doing? Hello, sir. This is Kyle Johnson. How may I assist you? Fucking hell. Hallelujah. I'm pretty pissed off. You know that. You know, I I'd love to hear what your experience was this evening. And uh, I'd love to make it right for you. Okay, good. May I ask your name first, please? Mike Burns. Yes, Mr. Burns. Uh, please tell me what, uh, what you're upset about this evening. The food was disappointing. Did you, did you dine with us this the evening? The food sucks. Tonight, 7 o'clock. Goodness. Uh, uh-huh. I, and what did what did you have for dinner this evening? I was really excited about the fucking soup when the soup arrived, just like a mush of fucking vegetables. You know, I'm I'm so sorry. I, and you said your last name is Burns, is that correct? It tastes like gnat's piss. Yes. Is I, uh -huh. I'm so sorry that you were frustrated with it. Is uh, was there something that we that we could have done in the moment? We would have loved to have brought something different if you didn't enjoy it. Have you ever eaten in the restaurant? Uh, I'm sorry, I, I, I didn't hear your question. Fucking hell. Oh, come on. Have you ever eaten in the restaurant? In, in what relation? I'm, I'm confused. What? What? Have so I ever eaten in the restaurant? The I'm so sorry. Yes, I have. Yes? I've eaten in the restaurant many times. So how would you describe the food? I, I think that our food is, is very delicious. I think that... Chef... But you're in denial. Goodness. Why are you blowing smoke up your own ass, telling yourself in a deluded way that your food's good? You know, I, I can tell that you're, you're quite upset. Uh, is, what would you, how can I make this right for you this evening? When are you going to stop massaging yourself and fucking get real? You know, we... We are quite critical of ourselves and, and are always trying to improve ourselves. Um, but I, I would love to find a way that I can make this That's right for you. That's a bullshit you, answer. Everything I tell you, you come back with the most pathetic answers. <clears throat> um, you know, what would you like for me to do, t sir? You're screwing the business. Where's the pride? I, you know, we have many guests every night who are so happy with our with our dining experience, and occasionally, you know, we don't miss the mark. What do you want, a fucking medal? 
it's it's uh, you know that's all that's I want to see is some form of maturity in dealing with it. How long have you been working here? I worked there about four here about four and a half years. Fuck me. No, I found it old fashioned, boring. It's even worse than I thought. Food shouldn't hang for a long time on the hot plate. I agree, yes, and we, we never have that as our intention. We love to get the food as quickly as possible to guests. Bullshit. I don't know why you think customers would leave their homes to come and eat frozen food. You know, I'm, I've got to be brutally I'm, honest. I'm at a loss for words here, sir. I, I would love to be able to assist you, but what if, to you're, say? if I, you're just I, going just to be upset and not let me words. know how I can help you, then there's... I, I I've never like said anything so stupid in all my life. And I, I'm, I'm amazed. I, I really am. I've never said anything like this in my entire fucking life. You know that. You know, I, I'd love to ask you one more time. What would you, what would you like for me to do? I would love to make this right for you. Maybe write your notice. You're useless, you know that. Here's it in a nutshell. You're not qualified. You know, I do, we do appreciate feedback that does allow us to be better and grow as a restaurant and serve our guests better. Uh, I feel like if you're, if you're upset, then I, I want to hear what your grievances are. And then we you can... need to understand. It starts with you. You can definitely do better. You only learn from negatives, not the positives. I think you need help. How do you feel about it? You know, I'm, I'm just a little, it makes me sad to hear what you're saying. Uh, unfortunately, you're not allowing me to, to do anything that would, that would change the situation. And honestly, your food's crap. That's the worst dish I've ever tasted. I'm worried because there's so much fucking around that goes on. So when was the last time you had a meeting? Several times a day. I disagree. There's no reasoning with you, is there? Are you 100% happy running that dining room? You know, I feel very proud of this restaurant and the team that I work with and uh, the experience that we're able to deliver to our guests. Yes, I But am. you're in denial. Clearly, we've got issues. It's not the way to run a business. You know, how, how, would you, how would you expect for me to respond to your phone call? I would, I would, I'm, I'm at a, um, a lot Oh, come on, donkey. It's such a shame. What the fuck did you put in that sauce? I'm, you know, I, I don't know which sauce you're referring to, but there are many dishes on the menu. It's fucking disgusting. Which are you referring to specifically? I mean, absolutely fucking disgusting. Disaster. Because this is the fucking pits. You blow smoke up my ass? How dare you? That is not my intention, sir. Who, who's responsible for that? For, for which, for, for what? Who runs the restaurant? Who's in charge of the restaurant, really? Uh, well, the Camelos brothers run the restaurant with us here, and, uh, yes. Started by their grandfather 64 years ago. Oh, fuck me. You're taking the piss, you know that. What fascinates me about you is you're either totally fucking oblivious to what's going on in your own establishment, or you're fucking living a nightmare inside your, your mind. You know, I, I would love to be able to, if, if you had anything that was a, a concrete thing that I could change or make right, 
Uh, of course, if it's related to the food, then we bring that to our chefs and we, uh, we improve the dishes. If it's something related to service, then we work on that with our team. And we are constantly doing that. And I'm so sorry that it, it just wasn't, wasn't at all right for you tonight. But, Rule number uh, one when learning to cook, you cannot store raw meat and cooked meat on the same fucking shelf in the same fucking fridge. So may I ask the name of the reservation that you dined under? I don't have a, a name of Burns who dined under. Um, Jay Willie. Casey Williams? Is, uh, I'm sorry. Um, Jay Willie. Never, ever seen such a disorganized, fragmented service ever. Hey, Willie? I, I'm sorry, I'm not able to find that name either. Oh, fuck me. Oh my god! No, are, are you sure that you're calling the right restaurant, sir? I, I... Yes. And unfortunately everything was painful. Stuffy oh. service. Pretentious food. The way you performed tonight did not tell me that is the man that's in control of his kitchen. Uh huh. I, yeah. If if you're just going to speak in vagaries, then I'm I'm not able to what? address the issues. What's wrong? Talk to me. I if if there are dishes that you didn't enjoy, we'd love to be able to revisit them and make sure that they're perfect. And if it was Disgusting. an element of service, then we would love this to be able to change them. Embarrassment. You're going to go then. You're going to run. Well, I, I apologize it, from the most sincere way that I can. And uh, I do appreciate that you reached out to us. It, uh, it's very important for us to hear from our guests. But I, if, please reach out to me and let me know if there's something that I can do for you. But it sounds like I, I'm at a loss of what to do for you here. Cut the bullshit. No point in making yourself look any more stupid. You're talking to a chef. You know, I, I apologize, sir. I do have a dining room full of guests that I, I do want to attend to. So thank you very much for reaching out to us. Please write me an email if you, if you would like to, uh, if you have something that I can You're make shit. Up. But, um, you really are shit. Right. I would have fired you, you five months ago. Dining room and attend to the guests who are still here. So you are uh, way I, out your depth. I appreciate that that you've taken the time to. Here's call, it is in a nutshell. But, You're um, not qualified. Yes. Thank right. you very much. I would have fired you five months ago. Yes. Okay. Good night, sir. Good night, Mr. Burns.